Hello there, my Capricorn Collective. I hope you're having a fantastic day. What's up, Capricorns? What you got going on? Oh, Capricorn, Capricorn, Capricorn. Oh, my goodness. This is all about you, Capricorn. So some of you, when the Wheel of Fortune shows up, choose you. Oh. Cappies, it's not that you don't have opportunities, but they might not be the best for you right now. Wheel of Fortune energy. Mm. Know what you want, Cappies. Think more with your head than your heart as well. Oh, Empress Energy, Page of Cups. Yeah, you have offers, you have opportunities. That's not the fucking problem. But that doesn't mean you need to partake right now. What are you doing? Set this the fuck out for a while. Eight of Cups. Yeah, definitely. Make head over heart decisions. Four Swords. Six of Cups. Oh. Capricorn, I think you've already been doing this. If you feel this energy, you feel this energy. Now is not the time for relationships or partnerships. You're focusing more on you. Uh, that's created a bit of concern. Because you're kind of doing your own fucking thing there, Capricorn. With the strength card. Mm. Damn, Cappies. Yeah, there you are doing your own fucking thing. You got an admirer energy, but damn. Damn, though, Capricorn. I don't think this is an energy you need to partake in. This is just like extra, extra burdens. Mm. I'm not your bitch, don't hang your shit on me. Yeah, damn. Trust your gut, your guidance, and your intuition. Oh. Now it's not the time for relationships or partnerships. Especially people that ain't coming at you in a good sort of healed energy. That's the inconclusive ten of swords. So someone's still got some healing to do. Before you could even think about a relationship or partnership. Cappies, is that your energy? It might be. Some of you now is not the time for a relationship or partnership. Hmm. Mm-mm. Damn cappies. Magician, the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. You're the one showing up good here, at Capricorn. So, yeah, when... You're like the opportunity. Be mindful of the opportunists. Four of uh, Wands energy here. Hot damn. Uh, a partner ain't a project. Relationships aren't projects. Be very mindful. Stay focused on the tangible energy. You're calling in such good energy. You do not need to fuck it up with your emotions. Uh, some of you now is not the time for a relationship or a partnership. Because you're looking good. Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, the world card there, the chariot. Good opportunities coming in. A lot of you are elevating. But who the fuck is this energy? You can't really build or create with anyone in this energy. You see that, right? And this is the inconclusive Ten of Swords. So this is that sort of uh, stagnant energy. Mmm. Cappies. I hope the hell you're not in that energy. Someone around you is. What's the real solution to the problem? Cappies, I think you figured that out. And someone else doesn't or hasn't. Oh. Be very this would be a very codependent uh situation, person, place, or thing. This person's in some dark ass energy. Here you are in this abundance. Happy go lucky. Ooh. Hot damn Capricorns. Pentacle energy here. Some of you be mindful, uh business opportunities you're like the saving grace energy capricorn damn though damn though capricorn
This is a Capricorn with opportunities. You probably have many offers for dates, but you're not partaking. Your emotions are removed right now because you're focused on the tangible. So you're in like this uh, problem solving. It's all tangible energy with you. The emotional side of things, not so fucking much. Not so much. You have opportunities. This is like a higher education. This is a, the opportunity to change your life up. Major changes in your life. Um, there's no codependency there. Some of you are supposed to meet new people, new opportunities coming in. Damn, but you got that stagnant energy. You don't need that shit in your life. I mean, just look at that card. Imagine trying to build or create with somebody that's in that fucking energy. Ooh, Capricorn. What the motherfuck? Capricorn, you need to make sure you surround yourself with people who have accomplishments, who have actually created their own sort of uh, happiness. This is like a quick fix to a shitty relationship that's very codependent. What is this inconclusive Ten of Swords energy for Capricorn? Ooh, King of Swords. Followed with the Ace of Swords. Emperor Energy. Page of Cups. Page of Pentacles. Oh. Lord have mercy. Uh, those of you, this ain't dealing with relationships. Just be mindful. Stay happy, stay optimistic. You're the opportunity, Capricorn. But then the opportunists show the fuck up. Damn cappies. Capricorn, whatever this energy is, I don't feel like you really have any sort of connection or tied to this energy. That's the whole fucking point here. Yeah, I don't... Uh-uh. Hot damn. You're attracting attention, Capricorn. Set this one out. New relationships or partnerships? What's more important to you? What's your plans? What's your goals? Uh, that four of wands energy, this would be like uh, someone turning down an a opportunity to go to school, an opportunity for a job, uh, an opportunity that would uh, sort of uh, allow you growth. But bringing in or starting to start a relationship or partnership that really... It's not a good fit. It's not a good match. It's not a good fit. It's not a good match. It's almost like someone's wanting to live your dream vicariously through you in a relationship or partnership. But that... I don't know. You can't trust this energy, Capricorn. Cappies, take what yours, leave what the fuck isn't. Not every reading is yours. Cappies, if, if this is like your energy, you know this. You're just focusing on yourself. Self-care, self-love. You're buying yourself things. You got a lot of opportunities. Uh, some of you could be traveling a lot. Damn. Gemini at the bottom, the Six of Pentacles. Yeah, it ain't like you don't have opportunities or options, Capricorn, but damn. Uh, you got, like, bigger things you're working on. 
Ace of Wands, the Ace of Cups. You are doing you. You are definitely doing you. You got a good head over heart balance. You're manifesting. Ooh. Capricorn, who have you given up dreams or opportunities for? And now you're getting those opportunities. You're achieving those goals. And now that same person that kept you stuck or that same energy is wanting to come back in because you're reaching your goals. Cappies, this is the difference between people who can achieve and those that can't. Someone wants to sort of hitch along to your dream. Mm. It would be a very codependent relationship or partnership. You got bigger, better opportunities. Take your time with something. Damn. Work life energy on this Capricorn, be quite honest with you. You do not need. Re you do not need codependency, and you don't need anyone that brings this sort of Seven of Cups illusionary confusion energy. That King and Queen of Cups energy is someone who is versatile, okay? So, uh, regardless of gender here, but damn, it's like emotional manipulation. Don't buy the fake shit. Capricorn. Some of you can afford the real shit. You don't need to be buying fakes. Be mindful of the opportunist. Especially when it comes to your emotions. Ooh, you are an achiever. This is an achiever energy. Uh, Capricorn. Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, Ace of Cups. We don't have Ace of Swords because I don't feel like this is really what the fuck you're even interested in. You're kind of doing your own thing. You do not need this energy around you, though, Cappies. Ooh, no, you do not. Good luck, God bless, peace, love, and light.